No, basketball is basketball anywhere you play it. Uh, certain regions in the country have a specific uh, game to it, uh, maybe maybe a tag to it. Like when you go down south, you know it's going to be physical. Yung tawag natin sa south, the basketball is medyo bara bara bay. You know, but uh, that's, that's how they love to play the game. It's very instinctive. Uh, it's, it's exciting. It's, it's, you know, uh, running up and down the floor. So there are certain characteristics in the different regions, but by and large, it, it's the same sport. Negros Island is a big place that has many sugarcane plantations and sugar centrals because it's the sugar capital of the country. And at the same time, uh, there are so many talented basketball players in the city and in the out-of-town areas. James Yap is a tremendous instinct player. I think he developed his game from an early age and you can see that he's got the build of a dominant player. Someone who can dominate from his position which is a two guard spot. From high school I saw James go beyond that level and play Super Bowl uh, for the University of the East and now that he's playing in, in the PBA. You couldn't ask anything more from James. I mean, he after all is a league MVP. The 2003 player of the year. Volleyball player, James Carlos Yap. James Carlos Yap. James Yap. James Yap. A beautiful Sunday. Uh, since grade 2, mga kabarkada ko naging ganyo sa akong magampang ano, basketball. So, kaya balay na mo, lapit lang sa, ano, sa basketball court. Uh, shoot lang ako ng shoot. <laughs> tapos ako ang pinakadako man sa ila. Tapos hindi ko maampang dalo, hindi umampang center. Gusto ko ako madala bola. The first thing I noticed, James, was he's so focused with his basketball. And in a very tender age of, I think, eight, he was really different from the other boys. Because when he plays basketball, hindi siya nakukonsyo sa tao eh. Basta it seems na parang he has his own world. Na he just play, love to play basketball. And most of the time, parang talagang wala na siyang ibang interest. Basketball lang. Nung bata ako, may ilig talaga ako mag, ano, makipagpustahan sa shooting, mga kalaban ko, mga ano, tricycle driver, mga malalaki sa akin. So, yun yung confidence mo, malaki. So, yun. Kasi, pag nakita nila yung kamay ko, akala nila 6'5", 6'6 ako, or 6'8", kasi malaki kamay ko eh. So, yun. Kaya, yung puunan ko yung kamay ko. <laughs> Kaya, tinatanggap ako ng mga ano, school sa Bacolod. Si James kasi, play lang eh. Puson, why mundo, why mundo, ruga mo ah. <laughs> James is the first player outside of Iloilo recruited by Iloilo Central Commercial High School. So he is the pioneer among recruits who came from Negros Island. He made the school famous because of his basketball exploits. When he first came there, uh, I remember his freshman year, uh, he averaged, I think, 32 points a game. He improved every year. That's what, uh, because he is very dedicated. In the school, there's a building, fourth floor building. He jogs from first floor to fourth floor. Tinatakbo niya talaga yun. Yan yung jogging niya. I asked him, ano ba yung ambisyon mo sa buhay? Sinabi niya sa akin, yung goal ko talaga, makaabot ng PBA.
kasi ako, namiyan ko magampang kung damo tao eh. Oo, oh, namiyan ko, do care ko, do feeling ko, galupad ko. Kung, kung mali up ka, do kay... Amo na na, na ano ni Tito, nakita sa ako na kung damo tao, do ganado ko, hindi pareha sa iba na players na kung damo tao, do hard look na nila. He really achieved all he wants in life. He dreamed about it and he achieved his goal. So I'm very happy for him. And he's still the same person, very humble uh, and uh, very caring. Kapag ayaw autograph, ang balo sa ila. Kapag ayaw ko mo autograph, na kung ano ko sa una, mamagyapong ko sa buong, hindi ko gusto mo na bro. James, before and now, is still the same. Tahimik pa rin. Uh, mahihain. Uh, the only difference siguro ngayon is hindi siya natatakot sa akin. Ah. Dati natatakot yan sa akin. <laughs> ngayon, wala na. Well, to me, it's a dream come true because I always dream one day that I'll be watching him on TV. In fact, I told a lot of my friends na this guy was still 12 years old. Sabi ko, this guy will be one day, will be one of the best players in the Philippines. Totoo naman talaga. I'm coming home, I'm coming home Tell the world I'm coming home Let the rain wash away All the pain of yesterday I know my kingdom awaits And they've forgiven my mistakes I'm coming home, I'm coming home Tell the world I'm coming home Ibigay ko lang yung best ko and gusto ko makatulong sa team ko. Siguro yun lang yung gagawin ko parati. Well, he was the 2004 second pick overall by Pure Foods coming out of the University of the East. He actually had a, a rather slow start sa kanyang uh, PBA career. Para bang uh, sinusukat pa niya yung kanyang mga jumpers at the time. But then, uh, uh, sooner than later, he got, it, he got it to the group. We got into an MVP group and led the Pure Fools to uh, multiple championships and became the man with a million moves and the man with a lot of moves. He 
the Granite Fingers for being patient. I mean, this crowd is rocking. Everybody's up with their feet, guys. The big three in each other's arms.